huge milestone for Grey's Anatomy. Tomorrow night it becomes the longest running primetime medical drama ever. And Nightline's Juju Chang talked to the entire cast about all of their most unforgettable moments. Hey Juju. Hey Lara, you know, tomorrow night is episode 332 of Grey's Anatomy. The record breaking <laughs> series, I know it's true, was also breaking barriers along the way, but it, at its core it's packed with juicy drama and pathos from plane crashes to ferry boat crashes, runaway brides to happily ever after. So when I got to sit down with the cast, I asked, what's your favorite episode? If I'm sleeping, don't wake me unless your patient is actually dying. From the funny... Do you have a favorite scene, a favorite episode? I always refer to the pilot because I feel like that's the one that established what our show was going to be. I just re-watched the episode that I got nominated for an Emmy for, which was Into You Like a Train. Get the leg! Christina Yang is running around the hospital looking for a leg. I want that leg. What are you doing? We're running! To the heartfelt. I like that episode where we got married and you ran off in the rain. Oh, yeah. That was such a nice wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Once they got me back. I'm your son. One of my favorite storylines was around family and parenthood. Didn't have a dad growing up and going to find him. But sometimes you got to be careful what you wish for. There were just so many iconic moments for the cast to choose from. But the episode mentioned time and again the season two powerhouse titled It's the End of the World, watched by a whopping 38.1 million people when it premiered after the 2006 Super Bowl. The Super Bowl was just the kepper. I remember watching that, by the way. That episode was really riveting. It, it had so many moving parts to it. I have my hand on a ball. I'm freaking out. Give us some of your private memories or some of the behind the scenes that went into that bomb scene. There was a stunt woman who was to perform that stunt where Meredith gets blown back. They attach a vest to her and then they would attach this cable to the vest and they pull her back. And the stunt woman banged her head on the floor and got a concussion and t got taken away in an ambulance. And then the director said, okay, Pompeo, you're up. Oh, no! And here's a big difference when you're 33 and when you're 49, is today I would have said, no way. <laughs> That's the power of no. You know, Ellen Pompeo says both she and her character, Meredith Grey, have evolved so much over 15 seasons, which is why the show is still going strong. And, I, you know, I've talked to so many teenagers who say they binge watch from the very beginning and then watch in real time. Yeah, a whole new generation has discovered this wonderful show. Juju, thank you. My pleasure. That was fun to watch. And you guys can watch tomorrow night to see the big episode of Grey's Anatomy, 8, 7 Central, right here on ABC.